As, as time goes on, the questions being asked of us scientists in terms of security issues are becoming more and more difficult. Let, let's consider an event where there is a, a, a ship coming into New York Harbor loaded with something that is either uh, radioactive or chemicals or oil, and the oil is released or the chemical is released to the environment. In the atmosphere, you'd like to know where that pollutant is going to go. Uh, New York City has many tall buildings and, and fields and meadows and, and streets. In addition, a big spill would occur and the water uh, would receive a lot of the, the impact of this pollutant. And then the question is, where was the water going to carry this? So the SRI uh, provides students with the unique opportunity to work shoulder to shoulder with some of the world's leading experts in maritime and port security applications. We pulled together students from around the nation. They were given a challenge to address the implications of a radiological dispersion and residual oil spill in the Hudson River. So Magello is a tool um, that's used to take information about the state of the ocean and the atmosphere and to project that into a, a, a means of informing emergency responders, the Coast Guard, for instance, FEMA, about the state of the ocean and atmosphere. So one of the, the core um, features of Magello is, is the use of the NOI-HOPS prediction system that Dr. Alan Blumberg and Michael Bruno established and builds on the data observing system and also the real-time forecasts which have been used by the emergency response community in New York on several other different incidences including the U.S. Airways plane landing on the Hudson River. What we discovered was that this data, it's all out there but it's all in different places and so uh, our, the idea is to bring it all together in, in one place, we can get uh, data from NOAA for uh, air temperature, earthquakes from USGS. We have a data source right here at Stevens, which gets us, uh, for instance, sea surface currents. We work closely with Rutgers University, and there's a system down there that uses CODAR to get uh, ocean currents. Regardless of what agency you're from or what your particular interests are, you can customize the website to, to work. For you. The whole reason for putting together the Summer Research Institute was to expose students to the marine transportation system and the maritime domain within a homeland security context. The Summer Research Institute is a really great experience where students from all over the country get together uh, here on campus and try and tackle issues regarding maritime security. The things that they produce ultimately have direct implications to our nation's maritime security.